Well, I thought our guys <clears throat> fought in the second half, and um, you know we got we we played a great team. Uh, they're they're ranked number three in the country for a reason. But our kids responded and, and fought to the end, and uh, you know dealing with first time on the road travel and. Uh, giving our kids an opportunity to go play in, in, in a great environment. Uh, I thought they handled all that well. Well, again, I think I said this earlier before. I think, you know, the past three weeks, our kids have had, had a chance to experience uh, any and everything that can happen in ball games. You know, we've been down, we've tied, we've been in overtime, and um, no different than playing in this last game against uh, Montana. Uh, we, uh, we faced adversity, and again, we responded. And I think it will carry. Uh, throughout the rest of the season that we handle ourselves and accordingly when we face adversity. And we got to do everything we do well. We take, the story don't change for us every week. We got to tackle well. We got to block well. We got to protect well. We got to uh, not beat ourselves and uh, just go out and execute. Uh, again, you know, we have several players. You know, I think our team collectively have um, shown that we, you know, they're players that, that, that make plays. And I think just from collectively, you know, we, we try to operate as a team. But again, you got Razzy Little John, you got the, um, Nick LaRue um, on defense that will help us. And offensively, you know, not the Xavier Burris and our, our quarterbacks are playing well, um, both of them. Um, and so I think uh, with the fact that we got a quarterback, two guys who will, you know, end up helping us down the line will, will, will pay dividends for us. I'm excited about this Saturday. Hopefully everybody comes out, the student section. Hope they'll be rocking, um, cheering us on. So can't wait to see them. Go Hatters.